here. I told you that we would be back again and I would be making the pasta sauce to go with the pasta that we just made. So let's get cracking on with it. I'm just going to turn my pan on. So these again are just things that are in my store cupboard. So I haven't gone out and bought anything. So what I've got here is I've got um, my olive oil. Just put a little bit in there. I mean, I could put lots of different layers of flavor and things like that, but uh, can't be bothered. <laughs> I'm really, really hungry. I'm hungry, hangry, hangry, hungry. You know what hangry hungry is? Hangry hungry if I don't eat soon. Yeah, I'm not gonna be a happy Lindy. So I'm just sticking an onion in there. I would normally use a smaller pan, but I'm thinking you can see everything here, so this is heating up. Great thing about gas is that you've got instant heat, isn't it? Fantastic. So you know what? Here are only one, two, three, four, five ingredients, but you can do this. All I've got is I've chopped up a tomato. I've got a can of lemon pepper tuna. Got some um, cream cheese because I can't be bothered grating any cheese. And this is called the best tomato sauce. The best tomato sauce, it is my tomato sauce. I have made it. I also sell it if anybody's interested. And I've got a pot on of water, which is boiling, which I am about to put some salt in. As the beautiful Nigella says, The water that you put cook your pasta in should be as salty as the Mediterranean. So I normally put quite a lot of salt in there. This is only for me, so I'm not going to make this damn top. See, look, so I keep on falling out the sides. My biggest issue right now, so I've just put the can of tuna in there. My biggest issue right now is that I don't want fat to get onto my shirt. That and the fact that my boot keeps on popping out of this. So this tomato sauce will give it a, quite a lot of richness. The good thing about um, not going live and actually uh, putting this on YouTube is this, if this completely screws up, I just delete the video. It never happened. This is the pasta that I made. Okay. This is not only even going to take a minute. Or it's even a minute. It's probably, yeah, a minute. I remember when we got the first offering of fresh pasta in New Zealand, you know, people must think, the Europeans must think, we're such bit of stones, because it came out, I think it was the late 80s, I'm not sure. So this, and we just thought we were so cool. So I've just popped that in the water, just salty water. Okay, I'm just going to mix it around so it doesn't get all stuck and clunk together. Oh, oh, oh. What it also may do is just put some pasta water in here.
maybe another 30 seconds. Do you know another recipe I'm going to do for you guys is corn fritters. Yummy, 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 yum, yum. my lunch I actually put a lot of salt in the um, in the water so I don't think we're gonna need that much in there is that people how easy is that so I'm just going to put this in the pan in the bowl that I had the um, tomatoes in this is so delicious I am so hungry This is all made with just what I've got in the cupboard. There's nothing fancy. Got that there. And let's see how it tastes. Even if it tasted rubbish, I'd never say so. But it might because the secret ingredient is love. And it's super hot. Mm. Perfect. The pasta is perfect. Oh, dento. Mm. See? What a lovely lunch, people. I'm done in about five minutes. Less than five minutes. Mm-mm. Sunday lunch. Love it. Bye-bye.